Howdy, folks. Thought I'd come see you today to talk about a little problem we got here while I'm down here feeding the chickens, giving them a little something. Um, I hate to say it, but I believe our problem started with President Trump. Uh, Miss Anastasia over there got daughter and son-in-law, and they ain't, uh, well, I ain't gonna say nothing bad about them, but they've been on them government programs for years. They ain't, they ain't had a job. I guess they kind of like it that way, but uh, they, they afraid President Trump's about turn their programs off, so they got all mad about it and said they're going to move to Canada. And, uh, matter of fact, they up there right now. They went up there to look for jobs. And I thought that was kind of stupid. If you're going to get a job, you're going to get one here. But anyway, they went to Canada and they, they dropped the youngins off with Miss Anastasia, you know, that being her grandbabies and all. She's taking care of them. And it's right here in December. It's Christmas time. Miss Anastasia's on a budget. You know, we all told her we'd pitch in and, and help out with them youngins make sure they had a good Christmas and all. I mean, you know, everybody wants kids to have a good Christmas, but Miss Anastasia, she's somewhat of a hoarder. And that that kind of caused a problem there. Them, them kids is looking around in her house trailer there and got up in one of them closets and they found one of them Sears and Roebuck wish books from 1977. And man, they done been all through that book and picked out just what they wanted. And, and uh, we don't know what we're gonna do. At that, uh, that oldest boy, I reckon he's about 13 years old. You know, them hormones start to jump around on him, and, and uh, he, boy, he fell in love with that Farrah Fawcett, and, and he wants one of them Farrah Fawcett bean bags and the Farrah Fawcett, you know, poster to put on the wall and everything. He's all about that Farrah Fawcett. And, you know, back in the day, man, she was something. She wasn't just Charlie's angel. She was she was everybody's angel back then. But anyhow, we don't know where we're going to find this Farrah Fawcett stuff for that, that boy, but we're going we gonna to try in that... Uh, that middle boy's got his heart set on that Evil Knievel bicycle. He he wants one of them Evil Knievel bicycles with the stripes and stars and stuff on it and that banana seat. And, you know, he just he just wants one of them things. And uh, that, uh, that Sears and Roebuck cassette video player they had back then with the Pong on it, he wants to learn how to play Pong. We uh, we don't know where we're going to find that at, but, but we're looking. You know, and uh, that little old girl, she done picked some things out of there. We don't we don't know where we're gonna find. She wants one of them uh, Miss Beasley dolls and and uh and she wants to be a ventriloquist, that howdy duty ventriloquist doll. She wants one of those and you know, we just don't know where we're gonna find this stuff at. So I reckon I'm just asking for a little help here. If you if you had one of them and, and you don't wanna tell us a little story about it, put it in the comments down there. If you know where we might can find one, let me know. You know, we we trying to make them kids happy, but I guess the real thing is if if you you know, if you keep old stuff like that, sometimes it can cause problems. So, you know, go through your house and make sure you don't have a bunch of old stuff in there that needs to be gotten rid of. Just go on and get rid of that stuff. That, that way you won't have problems down the road. But uh, anyway, I hope everybody has a Merry Christmas. And uh, this is Larry Leroy Lawrence, the last. You know, if you get a chance, subscribe to my channel there. But uh, I'll see you next time.